Hey guys, it's your girl Key. Thanks for clicking on me. And if you are new to my channel, welcome, welcome. This channel is all about biblical information, inspiration, Christ chasing, and exposing the nation. Bro, this is a supposed video, so I'm super duper hype. Not really a supposed video, but it is kind of sort of. But what is going on with this, bro? Have you, did you read the title? I know you read the title. That's why you hear you like, what's going on, bro? I'm going to show you what's going on. These people tripping. They are tripping. Spirit of confusing. They sipping. Watch this. Freaking crazy. <laughs> identify as non-binary using the pronoun they or there instead of he or she um but what about this having a baby okay i just want to say something like bro is is it that deep that you don't like bro it, I did have like a phase where I didn't even like my breasts when they started coming in, when they started developing because I was a big tomboy but I'm like bitch I gotta get used to it oh I even mean a curse <laughs> but i'm like girl i gotta get used to this i literally take down my breasts because i i wasn't feeling them and if i had to choose that i was a boy i would have choose that i was a boy at a young age and i would have made the wrong decision i would have messed up my whole life i wouldn't even <laughs> i would have been going in the wrong direction like bro oh <laughs> let me shut up instead of a baby it's a new term that some parents are using to show that they're bringing up their offspring gender neutral so it's a very interesting situation um and j just tell us a little bit about uh off rip this person does just bring me all like weird vibes this person like bro i supposed to be on one side of the camera i'll be forgetting i'll be forgetting <laughs> But this person right here just off rip. So you put the camera on their face. Weird. Like, it's like a spirit. Like, it's, it's like a uh. It's like a what's wrong with you? I be having those uh spirits. And I realize, well, those ill, like, those ill, like, feelings. And I'll be like, yeah, nah. That's when we leave. That's when we depart ways. Like, yeah, we can't. No, don't. Mm -mm. Keep it over there, baby. Mm. Um, Sparrow. Mm -hmm. Are you able to even sure. say how Sparrow was, you know, what gender Sparrow was born? Or is that something you avoid talking about altogether? Well, you know, the whole point of gender is that we don't know Sparrow's gender yet. Um, as far as what their anatomy is, uh, we do choose to keep that private, you know, to a, a short list of uh, caregivers. Now, How you don't know your child's gender my, 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 both of my sisters, they knew their child's gender when they was born. What? Whatever. They are living in a world of confusion. Just, just remember that. We are, we are watching, we, me and you, watching confusion right here, live, action. Now, this was um, not the situation, was it, with um, Hazel, who was your first child, because Hazel yes, you did that's... bring up in, um, you know, as a, as a little girl. Well, I did assign binary pronouns to Hazel initially, yes. Uh, and then when they were older, they articulated a preference for using they, them. Binary pronouns. pronouns. Well, just to sort of get my head around it, it's obviously very complicated. Um... What the freaking binary pronouns? Is that so that Dane Barrow? Just, just lay this out. Explain your domestic setup. You're, you're married, is that right? Uh, yes, uh, I'm in a multi-adult family. There's three of us that are... Multi-adult. You seen... Yo, you... Uh, an eight-year-old and my wife. You seen... <laughs> that was the thumbnail. That's the family, yo. You seen like two Bruce Jenners and who else? I don't know. I just know Bruce Jenner. Oh, and a Helen. <laughs> <laughs> oh, let me shut up. <laughs> and, you, and how would you describe yourself? You are. You were born biologically. Oh, I am, I am. Male. This is serious. I'm non-binary. 
They is crazy. Yeah, I'm non-binary, which means that you know, I don't identify as a man or a woman, uh, and I use they them pronouns. Okay, and your your wife or partner? So non-binary is just not. It's just not believing that you are a male or a female. Y'all remember in Genesis, my bro Isaiah reminded me in Genesis that God already said that He created human mankind in the image of him which is male and female do you see any other species human non-human mammal fish bird whatever human reproduce even plants i even plants have a male and female <laughs> no is it a wife how would you describe your other uh, house well, um, uh, all of the adults in my household identify as transgender or non-binary. Right, and but you're only married mm. to one, or you're married to both. Uh, legally, that's why, because they are transgender. <laughs> they trying to run away from like, I, if I ran away from yo, I would have been. I could have. Oh Jesus, thank you, Jesus, for keeping me. Woo. Thank you for my grandma for not allowing me to pick my own gender because, boy, <laughs> you like, bro, I don't think this is good for kids, bro. Okay, let me just. We married to one. Because it's going to be longer than what it's supposed to be. The one you're legally married to, what is their name? Uh, Bren. Bren. And, and then Bren identifies as? Uh, a woman. A Uses woman. she, her. Okay, and, that's and good. She, she was born a woman and remains identifying as a woman. Yeah, uh, yeah, she's she's a woman. <laughs> okay, and who's the third the third member of the? Uh, setup? My my partner Luna, who yeah. uses they them pronouns as well. And Luna is male or female, or non-binary. Non-binary. And I'm not about to. Luna. I'm not about to do none of that. Why you gotta like? Miller, is they a Miller female? Like, bro, non binary, his, like, bro. No. Okay. And you have two children in, in the house? Yeah. Okay. And just to clarify again, Sparrow, we don't know whether Sparrow was born male or female because you haven't said that. The Sparrow is now non binary? No. Uh, Sparrow is, I, I would say, antigender, which is a term, you know, that means before gender. Like, before gender. Who she thinks she talking to? <laughs> what? What is she talking about? Who? Who? And she believed. <sighs> Jesus. Jesus. Okay. This age are developmentally not able to really understand gender yet. It's just something that they're not. They don't have the understanding for. So it's not that the child is non-binary. It's that the child just doesn't have any gender yet. Right, but the child, I mean, look, let me try and get my head right. Like Why is she lying to herself? The child doesn't have no gender yet. Why is she lying to herself, bruh? Bruh? I'm pretty sure you wipe the diapers, bruh. You wipe the change diapers, bruh. You ain't got no gender. You ain't got no gender, bruh. You gonna tell me you ain't got no gender? Kill, calm down. Obviously, they do have anatomy. Right, so, so, so what anatomy does Sparrow have? Well, I mean, that's something that we don't usually discuss unless it's necessary with maybe a medical professional or, you know, a caregiver. They don't discuss the truth with regular people. Nah, they, they ain't gonna discuss the truth with me. Nah, they said, she already said it. So if you ain't here to freaking diagnose my people with some bullshit, I ain't bother. <laughs> Right, right. So, I mean, okay. I just wonder if I can intervene here because I think that a lot of people uh, find this very confusing. Oh, I'm sorry. And okay. it's because people think that if you are born with biological anatomy that indicates that you're either male or female, then therefore you have that gender identity. You're a man or a woman. But can you explain why you think that that isn't helpful? That the, the anatomy that you are born with biologically shouldn't dictate your identity because i think that's the sort of bigger point that your situation is trying to get to isn't it that 
Why are you trying to be nice? Society decides. What is going to be nice? Let me stop. It is going to be nice. As far as I'm trying to understand it, that is what you're railing against. Am I right? Yes, it's a, a great question and a great clarification. Uh, what it is is that, you know, yes, commonly people born with one type of anatomy will identify with one gender, people with different anatomy will identify with another, uh, but that totally negates the fact that there are legitimately thousands of people all over the world for whom that is not the case. So what, I would, is, so what um, I would say, I mean, just in, uh, you know, from that point of view, you're not necessarily dictated to by society. I mean, if, if uh, you she have is a crazy. girl and, you know, she's biologically a girl, she can decide and still be a, a she. This is, I mean, I'm putting this to you. I don't she think can... you can't call her a she, though. Sparrow's not a she. No, but... I know. So let's talk about a different <laughs> He's like, don't violate their guidelines. They're going to get mad at us. He's like, no, you can call her a she because it's not a she. You remember they in that weird. The non-binary, they don't do he, she. They gonna walk in your bathroom with a whole penis, the woman. Y'all, us. They gonna be seeing swingly. They gonna be like, I, I go as a non-binary. And I don't want to talk about my gender. I, I don't. This, this, bro. I want to have a penis too. I ain't gonna go out and get one. Mm. Girl or another girl. No, that's true. So I'm talking about a, a little girl who whose parents it's do call man. her a she. She doesn't necessarily need to, for instance, play with dolls, you know, do cooking lessons. No, exactly. And gender she just expression. Have to. Yeah, gender expression is totally different from gender identity. Someone can identify as a boy and you know, like any color, any toy, sports, dance, pink, mm -hmm. blue, whatever. And same with identifying as a girl or non-binary. People's interests or hobbies or, or preferences don't dictate what their gender is. When, and when does so having a preference? Yeah, when does Hazel dictate. decide uh, the anatomy, the they body parts? Uh, Hazel decided that they were non-binary when they were about four. They had been exploring a uh, gender before that, you know, d it, trying on different pronouns experimenting with different names at four uh, but they picked they them pronouns and at four at four bro if uh, i would have got a choice to pick who well, i would have been a boy at four because i don't that means i get to lie to myself be like i ain't got swoops i ain't got no vagina i got imaginary penis i want to stand up and pee like um, boys with my vagina because I get to pick because mommy, I, I get to do whatever I want. Like, bro, you gotta think about kids. Like, kids don't freaking know. Brilliant. Bro, we are still kids until we hit like 25, bro. Niggas still don't know what they're doing. We got, we got freaking grown up kids out here fucking age 60, 50. They still don't know what they're doing. But I can see how that could be misconstrued. Uh, you know, I think that every family environment is unique and say a Me child too. becomes a, a concert pianist very young age six why are we talking about piano well, maybe is it because their father is a pianist and they had a piano in that have you have nothing to do with nothing, nothing this has nothing to do anything earlier hazel has a unique education because uh of living in an lgbt family they have met people of different gender expressions and been safe to explore their own gender which has led them to a personal discovery. Is Does that mean Ari, 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 them? Ari, isn't no, this, no, isn't this just utterly exhausting? Amen. Keep up with all this. I mean, a lot of it, Amen. you know, I've got no problem with you leading any life you like. Honestly, no. I have it. You're, You're a grown. Really grown adult. You want to call yourself they and non-binary, whatever it is. I have total respect for You can call yourself rights, purple, Frankly, Rainbow. to do whatever you want to do. My Christmas. issue is what's happening with the kids Hanukkah. in your household. And whether actually it's all being driven by the adults in the home and not these children. I mean, Little Sparrow, we don't even know if Little Sparrow That's is a, a girl question. or boy. And you say we know how to call Sparrow they. Um, and Hazel, you can even show Hazel the picture. Calls Sparrow. Uh, their baby sibling. Their baby. So she literally says, good morning, baby sibling. Well, it, usually by name, like good morning. She can't even say he bit me. Asks, you know, who is that? They can say they bit me. That don't even make no sense. Yes. But then, yeah. uh, says, they can I have? You know, can I have a? This thing might be over, but then, bruh, Isaiah just 
when I was watching his, he was reacting to this, bruh, he bruh, spoke nothing but the truth. Why are you putting, like, plurals on one person, bro? Because it's not one person. It's the spirit that's dwelling in this people. They have multiple spirits of confusion going on in that family. And they're trying to put that spirit of confusion onto the child at a very, very young age because children are so easy to manipulate, bro. Believe as a child. That's why God, Jesus said, believe as a child because a child not going to question what a, a, a grown-up has to say that it's gonna go along with it like a real child like three four child bro they're gonna follow like bro try to be a grown-up and everything but what what else these kids do they follow the leader bro they saw the kids do <sighs> what the freak but at the end of the day, when it comes down to those spirits, these spirits are real and they are expressing themselves and they are like expressing themselves harder than normal, boy. Harder than normal. LGBTQ talking about they're going to add pedophilia into their own LGBTQ community, bro. What? You're going to add pedophilia? That's another video. Uh, that plays a game with you. Well, not when talking to them, you know, when talking to them, they would say you like, would you like to share a cookie with me, Sparrow? And Sparrow would, of course, because they're a baby. But if, I, but if I'm in, if I'm in the, but if I'm in the room and I want to have a cookie and I ask Hazel, can I have a cookie? And she says, yes, I'll just ask they, right? Sparrow. Is that, is that how yeah, them. I'll ask, ask them. them. Ask yeah. them. Yeah, you would say, so Hazel might say, I'll ask them if they want to here's share. What here's what I don't get though, because they and them are plural words. And I, I've always struggled with this. I don't understand why in this non-binary world, you would take a plural word. Yeah, I remember it's spirit. To describe a singular entity. It doesn't make any... I'm, I'm a grammatical purist. We are many. Legion in the Bible. Words. We are many. Why you would call people we. by plural titles? Well, well they actually have... I don't know if, I ever, if you watched that video when I was talking about my mother being possessed, but she was speaking in a third person, like... We had a person initiate something, you got another person agreeing, and then you got another person disagreeing. It's spirits, not just one person. These are spirits, spirits of confusion. It's demonic, bro. And they try to push it on to the kids. This is stupid. He has a history of being used as a singular pronoun as well as a plural pronoun. Back, you know, hundreds of years ago, 14th century, 1700s, you know, people used they singularly as well. But yeah, in common usage, they does have a... a I'm not going to watch all this. This is annoying. We are... How do you feel about this? How? Because I'm not feeling it, bruh. I was been so confused. Mac, when they try to confuse the babies when they come out of the womb. Like, bruh, they trying to get them going haywire. But, boy... If they strong and they seek the truth and they love the Lord, best believe they're going to rebuke their family. They're like, they going to rebuke them in the name of Jesus. You better get out my face. Period. But this your girl, Key. <laughs> Thanks for clicking on me. If you are new to my channel, welcome. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe to your girl's channel because it's nothing but biblical information, inspiration, Christ chasing, and expose the nation baby look at this you see what we don't but yes if you want to watch some more make sure you watch my next video okay mm -hmm. <laughs>